Let's try something. Something we've never done before. Let's use MK2 power poles so we can power these up. So two machines per constructor, or per power pole, I should say. I don't like the look of it, but it'll work. Put this over here. That powers this up. Let's just connect these conveyors and try to get this going. As soon as possible. Like it's not really going to make full use of the MK4 speeds, but I'm just using it because we have lots of these encased industrial beams. A splitter goes here. Or too steep, huh? What's this again? Oh, hang on. Put the splitter over here. And there we go. Now let's set this to wire. Get over here. So we got eight machines making wires, and we just need to turn them into cables. Okay, where are you? Constructors. We don't need to do anything special here. So we can just set this up like this. And we can use these MK2s to power the machines. There's two. There's three. Four. Five. Six. Uh oh. We need cables. Damn it. You know what? Let's just connect these. Have them make our cables now. Oh, come on. Really? Put them on backwards. Let's just hook this up right now. Cables. Have you make our cables while I spend the cables? Uh, 
uh, cables right here. And I guess we're not really doing anything with these things over here. this now I'll take these cables and then we'll finish the production line here okay so this is th three I think There's three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's just connect these. Oh, I need more cables. No problem. Let's just take it from here. Take it from here and... Wait, what's going on? Oh, you're out of wires. Okay. Let's just continue hooking these up. go all powered up now let's set this to make some cables here we go have cable production in here now okay what's next I already forgot the recipe. Damn it. Give me some cables. Okay, so we got the circuit boards, cables, we got the plastic, now screws. All right. We are producing more screws, which means we need to bring more iron ingots up here. You know what? Maybe we can like Grab some of these iron ingots from over here. I mean, it's not really being used, is it? Yeah, let's just do that. Well, first, let's get this up here. But not the splitter. We need a merger over here. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, 
And honestly, are we going to use these? I get the feeling that if we're going to increase the production of these heavy modular frames, we're going to need these constructors over here. We're going to need this space over here, so we can't put the screw production over here. Instead, I think we should bring it somewhere over here. So let's do that. And if we need to upgrade these belts to MK4s, we'll do that later. Okay, so we need to fill this in. And we might actually need a fourth floor later on. Probably shouldn't see might. We will. Because we're running out of space. Alright, so... Put the production over here. First, we gotta leave some space. So that we can have our outputs of the cables coming through here. Okay, so let's do... Is it constructor? Yeah, it's constructors. And wait, how many screws do we need? How many... Oh, we need 130, but... How much is produced? 20. Okay, so we could use at least 6. But maybe we should make 8 anyway. Okay, so constructor, let's bring this over here. It's one, two, and this is for the iron rods. Three, Four. Five. Six, except no. It's like one tile too much. There's even tiles in this game. Oh, we need more cables. Always need more cables. Just take it from here and let you produce more. Got six so far, seven right here, and eight. And let's see here. Or wait. Hang on, did I? Oh yeah, we only need four uh, iron rod producing constructors to support six of them here. That's what I did over here. So... Maybe I should do that. Leave some space here, and then... Actually, I took down the wrong ones. I'm thinking too hard about this. That's okay.
we'll have four of these constructors to six screw producing thingamabobs. Let's put down the power poles. Put the MK2s over here so it's nice and compact. All right, let's hook this up. Then we'll bring the iron ingots in. So we can use Splitter over here. Where are you? Oh, it's on the hard bar. Like sometimes I forget that. And then we'll put another one over here. you over here. Keep this going in this direction. We might actually need these iron ingots for something else so might as well. I say that a lot and then I see that section over there where I'm not using resources any further. Whatever. Okay so put the splitter over here. Put a splitter over here. Just so we're using both of these lanes. I think we can use a lift like right here. So it's automatically connected, okay. But is it? Yes, it is. Alright, so this over here. Put a splitter right here. And another splitter over here. Okay, so this is a bit difficult. Yeah, I guess we'll have to put the splitter right here. Somewhere. There we go. And I don't like the look at that. There we go. And we have this split up. Okay, yeah, that's all hooked up now. Let's hook this one up. Alright, so, got the iron rods ready to go, or 
iron ingots anyway. Start manufacturing iron rods. Oh, these aren't powered up yet. All right then. Just get this going and then we'll construct the screws. Alright, how did I do it over here? Okay, so at four here, six here. One side will be lopsided. So it's two of these things fueling three of these. Alright, just need to make sure there's room for these uh, mergers and splitters. Okay, let's see here. Okay, we'll merge it here. Probably not here. Because I'm not building in this direction. So let's put the splitter or the merger over here. And then we'll have three constructors over here. Let's put down the splitter. Split it into three directions. What the hell? No, it's a splitter I want. There we go. Now we can connect this and split it three different directions. There we go. Connect you over here. I'll accept that bend. Except it doesn't leave room for the power pole, so never mind. We should just give it one more tile. All right, so we make it two, so we don't have to deal with this. Or wait, that's not aligned.
There, that should provide us with enough space. There. That works. Yeah, let's just do this. And this will be screws. over here and you can connect there let's put down the other three constructors so there's one two Three. Okay, how are we going to do this? Probably should put the splitter right here. And then the merger will come from here. Where's the input? I got this backwards. Okay, there's a merger right here. No, we need a splitter. Input goes here. this here and then this really is taking a long time okay so that's working that's working that's working so we got some screws now I think we can leave this as is for the time being because I just want to move forward with this Okay, so we got our circuit boards. We need all of our ingredients going this way. Wait, so what is this now? Cables, got our screws, got our circuit boards, and then plastic. So I think we could put all three of these in this direction. See if we can make this compact enough.
Okay, let's see this. It's one, two, three, four, five, six. Then the merger on this direction. Two. It's three. And four. No, I got this misaligned. Okay, merger goes this way. There we go. And we'll do the same thing. Let's, you know what, let's get these conveyor belts first, or not the conveyor belts, uh, the cables. We still need to hook this up. I, I need to make sure the cables can fit in the middle there between the circuit boards and the screws. Oh, we need concrete. Okay, let's get rid of these first and... Well, we still need computers, so might as well dump these extra resources down over there. You know, let's use the hyper tubes. Put you down here and put our excess plastic over here. 